traders good morning good afternoon good evening i hope all of you are doing good in today's video we are going to quickly analyze bank nifty and nifty and understand the sentiment of the market on multiple time frames daily weekly and monthly and then we will find some stocks uh, which we can start investing for a short term uh, gain so let's quickly get started so we are on a nifty chart right now i'm using trading view today so if we look at the pivot levels of nifty so this was a pivot level on a weekly chart where market has started to bounce from this level from last week onwards and we have seen a great bounce from here and started moving up so how is the overall trend so let's uh, draw a trend line here and understand what was the mood of the market before so this was our trend line right so this was our trend line it was in downtrend continuously it was coming down hitting the trend line coming down again hitting the trend line then coming down so now finally there is a breakout on the trend line and it's doing a retest at this level so expect a retest at 17392 also uh, then start your uh, building your portfolios so this can be a good time for you to build your portfolio so let's look at this on a daily time frame on a daily time frame you can see that it was continuously falling how you can identify that uh, see the sellers were selling continuously from here okay they came down and then there were a lot of buying orders here so a lot of buying orders it started coming and this candle retraced now next day next day also this opened little higher than this so a lot of buying came here the selling is absorbed from here till here the selling is absorbed next day again sellers were less but buying was continuously coming then again selling happened buyers were able to grasp the entire selling buying again selling came buyers were able to grasp the entire selling so this means that it is falling now it is at a halting stage okay it's halting here right now so what will happen is either one party will lose here bears are trying to sell bulls are buying at this level so if bulls give up then it will start coming down from here if bears give up it can go from here so this is a point where you have to be conscious and mark this levels high low and if you see any green candle taking this high should be your entry for short term investment and uh, it can create new highs for the market okay so that is the trend of nifty on a weekly and daily time frame monthly you can see let's look at monthly chart also so this is our monthly chart monthly chart you can see there is a fantastic bounce from the monthly pivot and it's a green candle so the candle has to close below the high of this month's candle okay if you see this month candle closing here anywhere here about this high then it's a definite reversal and target will be 19600 this will be the target if it clears this level okay same thing with bank nifty let's look at bank nifty so bank nifty monthly chart how is it looking it's looking pretty decent now it's already cleared the previous months high and it is sustaining there so if this month this closes higher than this definitely it's going to achieve 47373 will be the target this is on a monthly time frame so this on a weekly time frame you can see that uh, just a second guys so on a weekly time frame it got rejected at super trend 
and if this candle pulls back completely and it starts to moving up next week then definitely you can expect a target of 47373 same thing what i explained you for nifty selling came from this level it is absorbed this level absorbed this level absorbed now it is at holding at resistance one which is 41982 and from here the next target is easily 43355 this is for bank nifty now let's quickly go to the uh, screener which we are going to use to identify if we can find any kind of uh, stocks which are giving any reversal so i'll use a simple daily candle outside bollinger band and uh, try to see and analyze if these are good for us to buy so the first one is bata india so bata india if you see it has been continuously falling okay it was it is below its 200 period and uh, now we can see a halt here this is a halt and it has given a breakout from here with good volume the target can be this one which is 16000 50 levels okay so you can buy for short term with a stop loss below this level this should be your stop loss and this should be your entry so entry and stop loss conditions you are well aware that whatever is your risk capacity for example if you can take 5k risk on every trade then divide this 5000 by your stop loss points okay if your stop loss points are 50 then divide this by 50 then that is the quantity you can buy that is what you have to invest okay so that rule you have to compulsorily follow for all your trades otherwise uh, your net uh, rewards will be lesser than your uh, losses so which will make you uh, non-profitable in long run so the secret to uh, success in trading or short term investments or long term investment is to cap your risk and let your wins run till the target whatever we have uh, set for ourselves so don't cut it before that and don't lose more than what you have already accepted okay so this is our first stock but is a good stock for us to invest second let's look at indigo indigo also indigo is much much better than tata why there is one reason because it is above its 200 period moving average okay it has consolidated below 200 now it's moving up so this is blindly you can go and invest in the stock indigo because this is one of the good airlines which has been doing consistently good work for uh, many years now second is indigo third is let's look at pd light industries pd light is below 200 condition one uh, so this can be its short term target okay this one but after that if you see a rejection you have to hold and then let it go above 200 then invest so maybe you invest 25 percent here for short term and exit but stop loss strictly below this level it is moving in upward channel so strictly below this level now next coming to pi industries Pi Industries is at a level where it is holding the 200 period moving average. So, good time for you to invest 25% here. Stop loss below this candle, 3148, below this level actually. These three candles low will be a stop loss. Any candle going above and the first target will be this level. And then second target will be this level, these levels, 3600. So it can break and make a new high from there. So these are the stocks for this week. You know, simple logic of, uh, you know, stocks going away from its median average and then coming back so that we can gain from that momentum upside. Okay, similarly, you can do it if you are a short seller, you can find stocks which are on the downside as well. So that's it guys. Thank you for watching and I hope you like this video and I hope you are learning something every week. If you are learning something every week for me, please do subscribe, share and comment and share it with as many people as you want because this knowledge 
is being sold by many courses and uh, I am giving it free of cost to you. So please, as a respect, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.